a force in the entertainment industry. Under the Pacific Arts banner, Nesmith has branched into feature films, serving as executive producer for the cult hit Repo Man and Time Rider. Nesmith has just finished work on another feature called Square Dance to star Jason Robards and Rob Lowe and has still another film underway. And I'm starting a new feature right now called Tape Heads, which is about, uh, which is a comedy about two guys who sort of fall backwards into the music video business and become wildly successful at it. Nesmith's own wild success in feature films did not carry over into network television. Last year, he created a TV comedy series called Television Parts, based on the style of his hit videotape, Elephant Parts. It was a ratings flop. Although disappointed with its reception, Nesmith says it was a good creative experience. Essentially, our instincts were right. Whether they were right for television, I don't know. I've retreated, in a way, back to the home video business, but maybe retreat's a bad word because the home video business, of course, is the biggest business in uh, the entertainment industry now. Mike Nesmith is testing his instincts again now with Overview Magazine coming out in January. The monthly videotape magazine is supported by advertising so it can be sold to the public at the very low price of $4. These projects and a new comedy tape starring Mike Nesmith are keeping him very busy. Too busy to devote months to a monkey reunion tour. But one night might be a different story. I'd like to try to get with him, you know, in some city where I am, maybe L.A., and play at least one concert with him. So even though he's become an entertainment industry leader, Mike Nesmith may still find a way to monkey around. I'm hearing the light from the window I'm seeing the sound of the sea My feet have gone loose from their moorings I'm feeling quite wonderfully free And I think I will travel to Rio Using the music for my life
of well-being. 